cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it there's up only two of them. Oh no, there's yeah, a you know lot what? more. We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! Whoa! Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole! The world out here has gone. It's like to one of those tryhards. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Here it is, St. John Family Dairy. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. It's just a prank, guys. He's not dead. <laughs> you betcha. He's gonna they come back like to life. Bugs and a zapper. We're pushing four thousand volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to. Yeah, I saw the cameras. A it's a prank. There's one camera. It has to be a prank. We've got kids in our group. Doesn't seem safe to have them near a lethal fence. Oh, don't worry about that. We got plenty to keep them entertained. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Oh, this hey, is my... girl. I'm St. John and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He moves around a lot, but... Things the way they are, maybe we can convince them to stick around for a while. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? I've got things under control over there. Well, I hope you know what you're doing. That place isn't safe like it is here. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Thanks, Mom. We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. They fresh this morning. Amazing. Buttermilk biscuits. Can't get stuff biscuits. like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. You Your know. cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. Mama. A vet? Butter. Oh my. Milk Our biscuits. prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some help securing the perimeter, then that's what we do. I don't trust him. So we gotta take a look around here, see what's up.
Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. How'd it break? Got busted the first day those... things showed up. Thank God no one was on it at the time. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Uh, I guess we'll fix it up. I'm gonna need some rope. And there's got to be a board around here I can use as a seat. Rope and board. Hmm, you know what? Let's go down here first. See how the gate works. Tell they built this thing themselves. So what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? Getting the perimeter secured is going to help us a lot. We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm going to get back to it. Pointy. Pointy. Hey, yo, Andy, Hi. what up? Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Yeah. If anyone tries to fuck with us, they'll regret it. Well, protecting your people is important, but in my experience, having that many guns around is when people get dangerous. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. <laughs> well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Uh oh. Do you think we're doing enough to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over-anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. It wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I... I'm... I'm sorry, all right? We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. There's one. Ugh. Ah. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Looks like he's stuck. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Disgusting. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Who do you think he was? It doesn't matter. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? The fortress needs people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. 
That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. I have a bad feeling about this one. Never get used to the smell, do you? Maybe the third <laughs> one. It's nope. always the third one. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. We'll go ask for more to eat after this is done. <laughs> I didn't feed him. Alright, I can suck it up. That's right. Suck it up, man. Come on. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. Who? <clears throat> <gasps> Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> what the? Get Archers! The Archers! Oh, Jesus! We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out. Go, go, go! I got you now. Ooh. Go behind the tractor. The blades are stuck in the dirt. The blades are stuck in the dirt. No fuel. Of course. Now we're gonna take one too. Give us the food! Oh! Come on, if we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Shit, that hurts. Come on, crouch lower, boy. Give us the food! You asshole! You got lucky that time! What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. Did you really think you could fuck with us? Damn! Gotta lure me to the behind the tractor! Where do you think you're going? Now there you are, boy! Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? I already got one of you. I don't know, I think it was two. Oh, that's not one of them. Whoa. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. The gate's right there. Oh. Oh no. Go 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 Rip Let's get out of here Close the gate Go ahead and run We ain't going nowhere Yep the crawlers Safe. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Fucking bandits. They have no right being out here. Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. 
I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have to I'm coming, out. Brenda. Well, you must so be nice. What kind of shit is this? We ran into the brown some people one. on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Christ, maybe you were right about this place, Lee. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where oh, these assholes I like his are? Voice. They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Hope you kids like swings. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. All right, we gotta go up here. We've never checked up here. Oh, I wonder what they're talking about, fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's yeah, go. We gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Goodbye. Clementine. Daddy will See be back. Anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's got to be close. We got some soup. That's not going to regenerate our hearts. This is real life. Here. Oh shit, you found it? Yeah, buddy. What am I shooting at? We're just checking. No one there. I think it's safe to plant the bomb. We're gonna go right. You see anybody? Stay on your guard. That's Watch not staying on I'm guard. Out the tent. Uh oh, he's getting greedy. Going for the tent. He's at quad. Can you molly it? Nobody? Okay. 
Flash? No? No flash? Okay, just go in. Man up. Get the headshot. Nobody's here. Pink. Clear. There's a girl here. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Get Nothing that gas. Fumes. Shit. All fumes. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <sighs> I'll pass. Ooh. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Interesting. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Uh... Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Nothing. Empty. What is that? What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. that Why? Dead, though. Oh, good. Good. Well, what else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily? I thought you were running things back there. Yeah, but uh, uh, she's got the combat training. Yeah, bro. Why are you questioning me? You don't trust me? Oh, let's get some stew. Or water. Hot water. Just water. Hmm. Look at the trash. Yuck. I don't need that. Where did he go? Oh, I see him. Your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. The men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat oh, her nice. Oh, boy. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. 
and I begged them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them, and I'm staying here till she comes back to me, one way or another. She'll come back. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. <gasps> take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. Huh? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down yep. to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for- oh. oh. Okay. God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. I That's saw a camera. Right it was a there. video camera. It was a still, prank. But there was no batteries in it, but... There was still a camera, so, though. So, if there's a camera... We going back? Equals if prank. Here, I don't know where they are. And it it's not real. Don't worry. Tromping through the woods looking for them. She's alive. So, yeah. We head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Come on. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. Mama! This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. I've Listen killed a man. Then screw it up for everybody, then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, Princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. Squabbling. with y'all, huh? Yeah. Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. What were you looking down for? Okay. Keep your eyes at eye level. Hello. Wait. Oh. What are you doing in there? With duck? Wanna see what these kids are up to. Gotta see if they're naughty or nice. Santa's gonna check that list twice. Oh, 
Don't mind me. Oh, okay. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Ah! <laughs> Whoa! Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Salt lick? Did you lick it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> she looks skinny. Anything I need in here? Go back. Uh, I guess we'll check everything. Might be able to find something. Useful? Nah. Alrighty. Nothing suspicious here. What is that? Ooh. Fast shoes. Look at the wheelbarrow. What Looks is like this? a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh. Smells pretty foul. A feeding trough. The music got quiet. What? I hear cows. I think it's about to rain. One more stall. Huh? Just some fence posts. found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look. That guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor, what'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No! Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. <laughs> Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Racist. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something?
What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? I'm a pretty straightforward you know, guy. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. 